Welcome everyone and thank you for joining us for today's ANX Technology Webcast. The latest trends in information, security, and risk management. My name is Julie Pham and I'm the Senior Marketing Communications here at ANX and I will be your moderator today. To our audience, please note that this is just one of many in a multi-part series on best practices related to compliance and risk management. For more information, please visit www.anx.com. Before we begin, let's cover a few logistical details. First, all lines will be in listen-only mode for the duration of the conference. Second, we do want to hear from you, and we'll have a Q&A session at the end of the webcast with Steve. So please submit your questions at any time during the presentation using the Q&A box or the chat window on your right and we will cover as many as possible. And last, uh, we will be sending you a link to the recorded webcast shortly after the event for your review. With that, it is my pleasure to introduce our featured speaker today, Steve Akers, Director of Managed Risk and Compliance Services at ANX. Steve is responsible for architecting and implementing ANX's GRC solutions and managing the risk and compliance programs for those organizations wanting a GRC program but lacking both the technology and skill set to do so themselves. Prior to this role, Steve managed TrueArx's customer and partner relationships, consulting teams, and overall service delivery for the organization. With more than 15 years of experience in governance, risk, and compliance, information, security consulting, and management, Steve was an integral de developer of the TrueArc Security Lifecycle methodology. With that, let's dive into the presentation. Steve, the floor is yours. Uh, thank you, Julie. Uh, thank you, uh, everyone, for uh, joining us today. Um, you know, I guess I want to start with, uh, for those that attended the, uh, the ISACA show, uh, I hope uh, you found it uh, you know, very uh, good uh, information sharing and an opportunity to uh, interact with your peers. I know specifically for me and uh, the other ANX people that were there with us, we had some really great conversations um, and understanding uh, a lot of concerns and uh, areas of uh, risk and compliance and regulations, et cetera, that people are uh, trying to address and deal with. And one of the things that uh, has always been true, and it seems to consistently be true, is that when everybody gets into the discussion around risk management, compliance, um, fraud, um, just overall the, uh, the growth of risk continues to be something that is always at the forefront of everybody's mind. And uh, you kind of see on the slide here in front of us, there's um, a number of different studies out there that talk about the cost associated with, uh, with the exposure of information, uh, breach information, et cetera. And the point that I always like to highlight here on this particular slide is actually on the fourth bullet point. One of the most interesting ones here, and I think this is true for probably most organizations, uh, but they don't necessarily think of it that way, is that it mentions here that 35% of those people that talked about what they're going to spend their money on is really focused in dealing with reputation. And I think that's, uh, that's a critical piece of this because uh, as more and more compliance regulations come into play, uh, due diligence can always impact um, you know, what uh, other activities and potential disclosure information can lead to. And sometimes you can be doing all the right things, and if you still have a breach or disclosure information, um, your reputation is clearly uh, can, be a, can be very much impacted, and this just further highlights that. 